What's good, YouTube? Because of Cobby here. So, Glenn4232, you said that we should do the entire Much Music 1997 performance from Silverchair. That's what we're going to start tonight. That's our next full show we're doing is this one right here. You guys have hyped up Silverchair for like a month. You guys have said their name, and we're finally going to get into it. I'm super excited to check them out. You guys have hyped them up quite a bit. If you're new here, please subscribe. We talk about mental health, addiction, world issues, everything in between. Break down all the lyrics, fucking stage performance, all that fucking wonderful stuff, right? It's an amazing time, very analytical, and we see some amazing shit on here. You guys request the most awesome music and performances. I love breaking this stuff down with you guys. So we're going to get into this on Bacasa Kabi, a reaction video a day or three. Keep the doctor away. Fuck those apples. This is Slave Silverchair live at Much Music 1997. <laughs> Okay, heavy, very grunge. <laughs> All right. the not metal kind of sense this is that grunge dirty kind of heavy i love it got that kind of stonerish slowed down feel break downy very slammy i like this right here <laughs> emotion man this is pure emotion right here and nothing but i love stuff like this and this is just emotion and pure talent mixed together right man they are solid as fuck and the drummer man he going hard the drummer's beating the shit out of those drums back there he's a heavy hitter i like heavy hitter drummers man heavy hitter drummers are fun I was one when I was younger when I was playing the drums. I was breaking my fucking drumsticks all the time whenever I was younger. It was a problem. Breaking drum heads as well. Snare heads. I was a whole fucking problem when I was younger playing drums. I was a heavy hitter back in the day. I love drummers that play with that kind of energy. This is heavy. And I like the deepness in these lyrics. Live too long. Now you've come to take me to a place where I can die. Lost my soul, lost my confidence in me. Can't be something, but I'll try. This is about mm, pessimism, right? Instead of looking at the positive that you could do with your talents in life or your the possibilities in life, it's saying, like, take me to a... I've lived too long. You've come to take me to a place where I can die. I lost my soul. I lost my confidence in me. I can't be something, but I'll try. Saying, I'm, I'm going to do this, and I'm going to hope that it works, but I don't fucking believe in it. This is a pessimistic side of the thought process right here. This is about, like, the depressive side of the thought process of success and stuff like that, heading towards success. I like the can't be something, but I'll try saying like i don't believe in myself necessarily and i got like cold feet so to speak right and i'm pessimistic and down but i'm still gonna try damn i like that <laughs>
face. Hell yeah, nice stop and scream there. I love stop and screams. You gotta appreciate a good stop and scream, man. Ha! Ah, his voice is amazing. He's got a really amazing voice. Perfectly fitting for this style of music. The rasp is beautiful and so clean at the same time. The drop to down whisper singing that adds that mumble tone that this style of music is well known for. The only time a mumble should happen in music, right? <laughs> is during the blues <laughs> and songs like this. Not in rap. <laughs> we just had to we fucking had to since we talked about the mumble style vocals really laid down whispery you can barely even hear what's being said inside of that style of vocal but it's sonically so strong even though it's quiet it feels so strong it's a feel thing i love fucking vocal styles like this this is one of my favorite vocal styles right here too long and waited to just drown in my self-pity I keep falling down mm. it's saying I've been here for a long time and waited for all of this to get better to just drown wow in my self-pity I keep falling down Jesus it's saying I, I wow saying I still ended up at the self-pity and I feel like I'm falling down I'm depressed I'm sad down in the dumps and pessimistic like we were saying want to be your soldier want to be your slave i have no pride in myself oh my god saying i'll submit to somebody wow holy shit there's an annotation for that section right there i wonder if this is about something okay yeah Saying you'll become a slave to anything to try to get that fucking thing that you want to obtain. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <coughs> oh my god. This is fucking deep right here. The pessimistic undertone to, like, what he wants to be a success story, obviously. This is very... Man, this is wild right here. This vibe is everything. Damn, I wish we would have started this sooner. They are fucking good, man. I, this is like one of my favorite styles of music. As you guys can tell, I really like the heavy rock emotional kind of shit. I think you guys have probably figured that out by now. And I really enjoy punk rock as well. Punk rock is another one of my most favorite genres that we get into on here. You gotta plug this in real quick so it doesn't die on us. There we go. We're all set now, man. Like I said, the vibe of this is fucking awesome. And the lyrics, only only book that I own is called How to Lose. Pick a chapter, I know them all, just choose. Oh my god. I relate to that shit, man. Man. Like, you guys, if you're new here, everybody that's here already knows. But if you're somebody that's new here... I'm nine months sober from alcohol, and 
just nine months ago pulled myself out of a hole that was pretty much meant to kill me. In a doctor's own words, they told me I had less than a year. And I lived my life in a very negative, pessimistic state. Even though I wanted to put positive into the world, it wasn't a possibility for me because my own addiction and my own afflictions just didn't allow me to resonate with that vibration, right? And I had to pull myself the fuck out of that. So I know all about the book on losing because I've put myself in a lot of stupid fucking situations and done a lot of dumb shit throughout my life. And it's just, you got to learn from that stuff and chill the fuck out at some point, right? Just chill the fuck out and learn how to live and learn how to be calm and settle into something. This channel is very helpful when it comes to that. For me, hanging out with you guys, getting your guys' advice, hearing your guys' experiences, the things that you guys share with me, or you guys really open up and share some amazing stories with me, and I appreciate you guys being willing to do that. That's what this channel is for. This community we have on here is amazing. Man, look, two lines got me rambling forever. You see how beautiful and deep this lyricism is like i said you don't have to say much to say a lot when it comes to a song these guys are really awesome i'm enjoying this too long and waited to find a place where I can die. Lost my soul, lost my confidence in me, gave me something, but I'll try. I just wanted to read that again because it's so damn deep. Saying, right? You've been, you feel like you've been here too long and you've been waiting to find a way to die, a place to die, right? Because you just feel hopeless, right? Give me something. Lost my soul, lost my confidence in me. Give me something, but I'll try. Man. <sighs> this is deep, man. Can't be something, but I'll try. Give me something, but I'll try. Fucking dark, man. <laughs> <laughs> they are fucking tight dude they are tight as fuck that was solid what a solid performance man i am fucking glad that you requested this glenn thank you thank you for this request this is gonna be a fun fucking show to watch i already know you guys know we're gonna have a blast with this one i'm so glad to be here on this oh my goodness man I love it. I love everything about it. Like, so solid. Wow. And it's 
like I love the blurriness of the video. You guys know that I love the old style footage. And the audio quality is super fucking good on a live cut. It's, they are studio quality live, just like all the other bands we've had on this channel. This is fucking gonna be fun and amazing. I cannot wait. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you. If you want to donate, links are in the description. You'll get put on the list. All your requests will get bumped up to the top. I appreciate you guys so much. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Bakasa Kabi. A reaction video a day or three. Keep the doctor away. Fuck those apples. Leave a like for me. Comment suggestions. Subscribe up this way. Bang that notification bell. I'll see you guys on the next one. I love you so much. Thanks for everything. Have a beautiful one. Peace.